So here we have 9 over 4 raised to the 9 over 4th power, and we are going to rewrite this into simplest radical form. And we cannot have a radical in the denominator, so keep that in mind. So how do we do this? First off, we can rewrite the following, right? 9 over 4 as 3 squared over 2 squared, so I will just put it down like so. And then raised to the 9 over 4th power. And the reason that we want to do this is so that we can just multiply these two powers and they cancel out pretty nicely, and we will get 3 over 2 raised to the 9 over 2's power. Okay, what can we do next? Well, I'll tell you. Let's just go ahead and do 9 over 2, which is 4.5. I know, but like, let's use fractions. This right here, it's the same as looking at it as 3 over 2 raised to the 4 and of half, right? So it's pretty much 4 plus 1 half. And the reason I want to write it like this is because now I can break this apart as 3 over 2 raised to the 4th power times, and then here we have the 3 over 2 to the 1 half power, thanks to the rule of exponents. Now work this out. 3 to the 4th power, 3 times 3 times 3 times 3, work that out, we get 81. And then 2 to the 4th power, we will get 16. But what's this? Well, we have the 1 half power, that becomes the square root, and then inside we have 3 over 2. But technically this is not done yet, because in algebra, we always want to have uh, the radical, we don't want to have the radical on the bottom. So this is what we can do. Let's multiply the 2 and 2 here, because 2 times 2 in the square root is square root of 4, huh? which is just a regular 2. So this right here will become, still right here we have 81, but this right here is just going to be a regular 2 on the bottom, so 2 times that, which is 32. And then right here we have square root of 3 times 2, which is 6, and we can put it on the side, we'll put it on the top. Let's just put it on the top like so. So this is the final result, 81 times the square root of 6 over 32, and that's how I simplify a radical, sorry, that's how to simplify a rational exponent to its simplest radical form. That's it.